Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you 5 hacks that you should be using as a Power BI developer to save hours while developing a Power BI report. Let's jump in. So the first hack would be copying and pasting the queries from the Power Query. So let's come to the Power Query. And from here, let's say I want to copy any of the queries out of the 5. Suppose I want to copy this query. It might be that I want to copy the source credentials or I want to copy the transformation steps. So right click and copy and I can paste this in any Power BI report. So I can go to a different Power BI report and here let's go to transform data. So this is a blank report. So you can see the queries are as zero. Here I can just right click and paste it. So it will be copied here. So this was the first hack. The second hack is Suppose I have a table where I have a huge number of columns and I want to search a particular column inside the table in Power Query. So for that, instead of just scrolling left and right, we can directly press Ctrl plus G, which will open the go to column and here I can search for that and just click on it. So it will take us to that column in that particular table. This was the second hack which I use frequently. The third hack will be selecting and moving the measures in bulk. So for that, we can go to the model view. And from here, you can see these are the measures. So we have a measure table called all measures where we have these two measures. And you can also see we have created some measures inside this order details table. And we want to move all the measures that are existing in this table to the all measures table. For that, we can just right click on this table. And from here, we can click on select measures. Once all the measures inside the table selected, we can just drag and drop to all measures. So all the measures will be selected and moved to a particular table. So this was hack number three. Let's move to the hack number four. So this hack is basically used in DAX. Suppose I have this measure and I have reference of this measure total sales in many places for 10 to 15 times for example and I want to replace it all at once. For that I can just press Control Shift and L. It will select all these measures and we can just type a different measure for example orders and just click on enter. Next will be if I want to copy the same line to the next line we can just type Alt, Shift and Down. It is going to copy this line as many times we want. So this was the hack number 4. So now comes the final hack. That is hack number 5. Suppose I want to delete the measures, columns or tables in bulk. Generally what most people do is they just click here and right click and click on delete from model and then click on yes. But whenever I want to delete, suppose I want to delete all these four measures at once, I can click on the first measure and then shift and select all the measures and just press delete on the keyboard and click on enter. It will delete all the measures. Now suppose I want to delete all these columns from the order details. I can just click and shift click to select all the columns and just click on delete and enter to delete all the columns. Now I want to delete all the tables so I can click on this table and shift and select all the tables and just click on delete and enter. It will delete everything. So these are the 5 hacks that I use frequently while developing a Power BI report which saves a lot of time. If you have learned something from this video, do not forget to subscribe. Goodbye and thanks for watching.